Hiya, I'm Vicky and welcome to Pretty Little Claws. In today's video, I'm going to get messy with some spider gel and some pigments. Enjoy! Right, so for this design, I have already prepped these nails. So this is coloured in with Snow White. Left this one for now, and then this one's Serious Black. So I'm going to show you how to use the spider gel. Right, so I've already done that in black. I'm going to top coat it because I don't want a sticky layer. So if these were on natural nails, you would dehydrate and prime and put a base coat in. So I'll pop that in for a minute. So this one's set now. Give it a good clean, nice wipe over. So with the spider gel, it's really, really sticky. And you're just gonna dip in and you can see how it drags. And you're just gonna repeat that. I'm just using a dotting tool, drag the product over. And you can just like loop it. Obviously, if you're doing this on a client, the cuticle would be a mess. So you just make sure you give it a good clean. Right, so it is really messy. So I've just gone for straight lines up and down, and then I'm gonna put some pigment over the top of that. I'm gonna pop that under for 60 seconds. So now the spider gel's cured, but because we've wiped that background, the pigment shouldn't stick apart from to the spider gel. So I'm literally just rubbing it over. I'm going to brush it off using a little fan brush. It just gets rid of all those extra flakes. Rub that in a little bit more. I feel like I can do it better with my finger than using the applicator. And the flakes are amazing. So many different colours. And obviously to keep that design in, I'm going to go over it with a top coat. And then cap it. There go. Pop that under. 60 seconds. So I'll do a bit more of a design. I'm gonna use Prom Dress from the Shimmer Collection. I think that'll go really nicely with the pigment that I'm using. So I'm gonna do a straight-ish line. I'll go in with a detail brush in a second. and pop that under 30 seconds. Second coat of prom dress. So cap it. Doesn't matter too much about that straight line because I'm gonna go over that with the spider gel. Pop that in for another 30 seconds. Right, so again, I'm just gonna top coat that design in without the fluff. One minute, let me just give it a quick wipe over. Again, with the dotting tool. No. Oh God, get it stuck to you. Pop it in and then what you're going to do is lift it up out of the pot and then over the nail. And you get a really nice straight line doing that. I'm going to keep going just to show you how I've done it. You can go whatever angle you want it. So it can go that way and you can do loads as well so you could do it really quickly and get that proper like spider webbed effect. I'm just 
just going to pop some more up this top end of the nail, like where the cuticle would be, just dragging it over. Clean off my dot and pull. And also, like, if you think you've got too much, you can just scrape it off. It's just hard to get off because it just likes to wrap. And that's how you use spider out. And pop that under for another 30 seconds. So now with this, I'm not going to put any pigment on this one. I'm just going to go straight in and top coat it. Pop that in there for 60 seconds. And with this one, just to kind of like tie in with a the theme, I'm just going to use prom dress again. Again, on a natural nail, you'd use a base coat. But because these are plastic tips, I don't need that. It. Pop that under for 30 seconds. I'm going to do a second coat of prom dress. Pop that under 30 seconds. Right, so now I'm going to use the Urban Graffiti base coat. And because this will have a sticky layer, I should be able to put the little flakes onto the nail. I'm going to pop that in for 60. So now we've got the base coat with a sticky layer. Just start patting and rubbing the flakes. Like, how nice is that? On top of prom dress. I've just gone like diagonally over the nail because I don't want to cover that really pretty pink. But I like this purple and blue that's like running through it. I'm going to pat that down and then I'm going to seal that in with the top coat. You can see all those colours from the pigments coming through. Love it! Pop that under, 60 seconds. And there we have my little finished tips. I think they're really cute. The spider gel is dead effective. Obviously you don't need to put as much on as this. You could do it dead sparse, put it with a black background. You could put it over this, like diagonally. I love it. It's just dead versatile and it's so fun to play with as well. So yeah, well I hope you enjoyed this video. I know I did. Uh, all the products are listed below. Uh, give us a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, drop us a little comment. I might get back in touch with you. Um, yeah, so I'll see you next time. Bye!